After compiling that information together and creating the, the records that we're going to publish into DNS, the next step is logging into our DNS provider and publishing those DKIM records in DNS. So to publish the DKIM records in DNS for this domain, we're going to go log into GoDaddy because that's where uh, DNS is hosted for this domain. And I'm going to create a new CNAME record. So what I'm going to do is copy my uh, record on my domain. And we're going to create a new domain. So we're going to add. The type is going to be CNAME. The host is going to be just in the case of GoDaddy, it's going to be selector one dot underscore domain key. And that's going to point to the other portion that we created. Okay, so as a CNAME record, what this is going to do that is anything that goes to selector one dot underscore domain key dot modern digital office dot com is going to get redirected to this web page uh, that is hosted by Microsoft. And that's why we're creating a CNAME record. We're going to add one more, and it's going to be that selector two. So again, it's going to be a CNAME. Take the selector two record. And again, since we're on GoDaddy, again, since we're on GoDaddy, we don't have to provide the entire domain as the host. We just need the, the subdomain that's getting added to this domain. And that's going to point to that domain at Microsoft. And that's it. Once those DNS records have propagated across the internet, then we can perform our test.